comment below glow yachts out there, everybody. All righty, we're going to keep this thing rolling after a moment from our sponsors, Docs Lab. Make some noise for Docs Lab, everybody. The Asylum Productions, FCC Free Radio, which I have been on many times. Make sure you support them. Hello. The Punchline and Cops Comedy Club. I'm standing Punchline on the right side of the screen. My last comedy album, Vasectomy Money. Uh, it's, called, it's called Vasectomy Money. You can go on iTunes, pick that up. Shameless plug for me. Anyways. U.S. Pure Water, Rock Medicine, Reality Check TV, SF Rec and Park, three still standing, photos in, a flash. And now back to our regular scheduled comedy show. Ladies and gentlemen of San Francisco and Golden Gate Park, you ready for your next comedian? This is very exciting to be your next comic. We've done a lot of shows together. She's really awesome. And a great, awesome thing that she's doing is on October 2nd at Cobb's Comedy Club, she's going to be doing a Joan Rivers Memorial Show. Make sure you check that out. Joan Rivers, rest in peace. We love you. But that being said, some ha-has are coming your way, courtesy of the lovely and talented Mary Van Notes. <laughs> Thank you! So good to be here! This is awesome! Ugh. So my boyfriend's super stressed about being broke, which makes me just super stressed about finding a new boyfriend. It's tough. I saw a book at the grocery store. The title was Men Who Knit. And the dogs that love them. That's a real book that has projects like making matching sweaters for you and your poodle. That is such a specific demographic. It has to be men, and then those men have to knit. And then those men have to have dogs and then those dogs have to love the men and then those men need to know how to read yeah that's a hard sell I got a tattoo yeah it's in 3D. When people ask me what it is, I hand them 3D glasses. The tattoo is of an open hand. It says, now give me the glasses back. I went to Canada, and I got stuck in customs for four hours. And when the customs guard finally let me go, he's all like, please come back to Canada. I said, I'm never coming back. Um, no, sorry, it was more like, I'm never coming back. But it was more like, I'm never coming back. But it was more like, I'm never coming back. But it was more like, I'm never coming back. But it was more like, ah! Yes, 
bystanders, right? I was confused because he was wearing lapels. Believed him. That joke was brought to you by our Comedy Day sponsor, NBC Bay Area. I'm actually a good person and I did a good thing recently. I donated blood. Give it up for that. That's a really good thing to do for the community. Yeah. To be honest, it was just super convenient because it was coming out of my vagina anyway. Yeah, the guy at Goodwill didn't even appreciate it. I'm like, that's a gallon. Save some lives. Yeah, I'll take a receipt. Thank you very much. I've been Mary Van.